Oh boy, I'm excited. Sleep Theory has released a new song. This band is one of the few that I'm really keeping my eye on. I, I said I really weird. Eye on. Eye on. Because um, they just did, they're about to hit that point. These fucking dogs upstairs. Anyway, they're about to hit that point of like just ramping. They're going to take off them. The warning. There's a few bands that I'm like really watching right now to see what they do because I just got a feeling, dude. And this is one of the big ones. So let's get into it, man. As always, if you guys enjoy, smash the like, subscribe, check out the Patreon and merch store. And let's see what a uh, new sleep, sleep theory sounds like. I'm all over the place today. Jesus Christ. Starting off quick. I love his voice too. He's got that seven dust feel, man. Who I saw seven dust live? Go see him live. They're fantastic. You see me walking away, and I know that the last thing you said was another regret. I won't feel, but it's not what you. He's kind of showing off his vocal chops here a little bit, isn't he? Oh, you hear that little bit of a little bit of gravelly stuff coming through there? Mm. As you can tell, I'm not a vocal technician. <laughs> gravelly stuff. This is a lot more of like a radio friendly catchy song, but it's still really good. The last one we did is definitely more my style, but this is great. That one, Fallout. Fallout up here in the corner. Go check it out. Fantastic song. I love it. That's probably my favorite one off this album so far. This is really good though. Yeah, this is that one that's going to be on the radio everywhere. This is good. This is real good. I like this. I like that a lot. That was that was more of a radio friendly, catchy kind of song, but that was really solid. Oh, songs like that are good and and I love them. But I don't there's not much to say. They're just kind of straightforward. You know, like I can't really give you too much. It was a good, good, solid song catchy nothing crazy you know there was nothing out of the there was no random breakdown thrown into it which a lot of bands are doing now which is starting to piss me off 
I'm gonna be honest. If if I get one more goddamn song that is like intro, verse, chorus, verse, chorus, breakdown, and then like key change, chorus, outro kind of thing, I'm like <clears throat> it's the same shit over and over. Um, yeah. <laughs> take take that little thing that I just laid out and go listen to a bunch of songs. I guarantee you find like 12 of them. But fantastic. I swear to God, I think this band is gonna be is they're gonna be massive. They seem like they're gonna take off like a seven dust. They have that same feeling like back in the early two like a seven dust breaking Ben Godsmack era of like rock music coming up that's not like metal metal but not soft rocky. Like they're in that that middle ground area where they got some screaming, but they got a lot of really good singing. Like that's where they're going to be. And it's really cool, which is good too, because a lot of bands that are coming out are like hardcore. So you need these bands that are more of the breaking band. Godsmack. Uh, what the fuck else did I just say? Seven dust. You get the point. The uh, Chevelle, you know what I mean? Um, just good, solid bands. So I'm excited to see where they go. They seem like they're going to be great, so yeah. Let me know in the comments what you guys thought. And as always, if you guys enjoyed, smash the like, subscribe, check out the Patreon and merch store, and I will catch you in the next one. As always, stay happy, stay healthy. Later.